During 1995, the single-channel dried fruits of divine marketing legislation enjoyed by SAD was brought to an end by the new South African constitution. This created the opportunity for entrepreneurs to enter the raisin market. South African raisins enjoy a very high demand worldwide due to fine quality as a result of unique climatic conditions and world-class farming practices. When the sugar content is sufficient, the grapes are harvested. The grapes are differently prepared and dried to produce Thompson's, Golden's, OR and Beerpeer raisins. Thompson seedless raisins are prepared by drying grapes in the sun. Golden seedless raisins are prepared by dipping the grapes in sultana oil and fumigated by using sulfur dioxide and drying on trays. Fruits to suit was established during 2002 with due consideration to locality to suit the farming community, availability of labour, water and nearby ESCOM power, telecommunications and infrastructure of Kanon Island community. Fruits to suit was bought by Desert Raisins together with Afrifresh Group during December 2010. In 1998, Afrifresh purchased a 50% shareholding in Fruveg from the well-known Fine family. This merger repositioned the two companies among the top five exporters in South Africa. Average 60% of Fruit de Suits products come from Afrifresh Group farmers. These farmers conform to the Global Cap standard. Each batch delivered are weighed. Each batch receives an intake number. This number is used for traceability. The bins of the batch are marked with intake number and the bin count of the batch. A sample of every intake number is graded to choice, standard, industrial and of no value. We look at quality defects, example color, blemish, texture, etc. These samples are stored for the production period for this crop. The moisture of each batch is measured using a moisture meter. The moisture should be less than 14% on intake. A sample of every intake number is tested for MRL. Selective samples are sent away for aflatoxin and heavy metals. All farmer stock are fumigated before entering the factory for production. This is the pre-cleaning area. Most stalks and foreign material are removed and some color sorting are already done. This is the laser scanner and two magnets on this line. There are two main production areas, the dry and the wet areas. This is the dry area. In this area, stalks and foreign material are removed. The product is sized and cap stems are removed. Aspirators are used to remove stalks and other foreign material. Sizing shakers are used to sieve raisins to different sizes. Decapper and aspirator are used to remove cap stems. In the wet area the product is washed, color sorted and packed into cartons. These stoner and water bath remove stones and are used to wash the raisins. This is the second laser scanner on the production line. The laser scanners are used to color sort the product and to remove foreign material. A hand-picked team on the belt remove any defects from the product. Vegetable oil is added. The maximum specifications is 3 grams per kilogram. Online oil testing is done as well as analysis of the finished product. Food grade liners are used. It is bought from approved suppliers. The traceability code is stamped on the carton. It consists of the production date and the intake number. 
A 100 gram sample is taken. All defects weighed and recorded. If a product is out of spec, it will be downgraded or reworked. Online samples are kept for the shelf life period. Each carton packed is weighed. The scales are verified three times during each shift. Cartons are sealed. The metal detector is identified as a CCP. The metal detector is monitored hourly using test pieces. We have an online label printer. Labels are verified by our customers before it is used. A sample of every pallet is checked. If it conforms to specifications, the pallet will be approved. Approved products receive packaging slips and are recorded on the pallet report. These records shall be used for tracing purposes. Process control include monitoring magnets, scales, online oil content, destoner and metal detector. Bad sampling and laboratory analysis are done. These results are used to compile a COA for the batch. Analysis include physical defects, moisture content, sulfur dioxide, octatoxin A, and microbiological analysis. Fruits de Suit has implemented a new prepackaging line in 2011. Only approved bulk packed products is used. Each bag is weighed. Fruits de Suit has a laboratory on the premises. Equipment are calibrated by an external laboratory. Approved methods and competent staff are used. Sufficient staff and hand wash facilities are available. All staff are aware of hygiene practices. No smoking, jewelry or personal items are allowed in the factory. Only food grade SABS approved cleaning chemicals are used in the factory. It may only be dispensed by trained staff. Fruits to Suit has a pest control program in place. We make use of a registered pest control officer. Fruits to Suit has a water treatment plant on the premises. The quality of the water are monitored. Turbidity, chlorine, chemical and microbiological testing are done.